What's up, everybody? It's Boy Z Man here to bring you the next part of The Walking Dead Episode 2. Starved for something. We're starving. And, well, um, you, you, you may notice by the brick, well, it's called the salt lick, salt lick on Larry's head, that uh, in the last part, something big happened. We found out that the St. John's had been using Mark to feed themselves so mark has been mark's dead and while we figured that out they threw larry and the rest of us in here and larry had kind of a heart attack so we made the tough decision to help kenny kill him and that's where we stand we're stuck in a meat locker st john's have kenny's family so we got to help kenny get the hell out of here i want to talk to clementine really quick i don't think we can talk to her but we can talk to kenny you, uh, you think maybe we were too hasty? Only one important thing right now. Getting the fuck out of here. We did what we had to. You sure about that? It's just you and me. Lily's in no condition to help us rescue your family. Considering what just happened, she probably side with the St. John's against us. <laughs> That's a good point. Alright, um, we have to figure out a way out of here. And earlier they gave us lots of different opportunities, but the only way out of this meat locker is through the air conditioner. There ought to be an air behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Which we don't have. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. Coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh -uh. Anyone else carry coinage around here? So we got these screws that we need to pull off before we can take off the AC unit. Earlier in this episode, when Larry was talking to Mark, he mentioned that he had uh, like 30 or maybe it was 65 cents in his pocket. That, um,. He would give Mark, so, you know, he has to have some coins, Lily. Um... Lily, I'm, I'm sorry. Don't talk to me, Lee. Don't fucking talk to me. I know you hate Kenny, and me too. But he did what he had to, so we can all go on living. For what? He's got his family, and you've got Clementine. I've got nothing. You left me with nothing. You could have had I less. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry, Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. If he was alive and had the key to getting us out of here, do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. <sighs> Alright, so at least we can uh, grab those coins out of Larry's pocket without pissing off Li Lily too much. Clementine, I'm very sorry. Because, you know, <laughs> this is just insane. Let's go ahead and oh grab these boy. coins out of his pocket. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? You fucking vulture! Alright, we've only got like two choices anyway. We got, um... Well, three choices. Back pocket. I'm guessing uh, if he's like me, he keeps him in his right pocket. Here we go. Yeah. Two quarters. And a dime. Sixty cents, whatever. I said sixty-five or something. Alright. Let's go ahead and use them Just coins. Move these screws and get this unit off. On the screws of the unit, and we'll be able to hopefully get out of here. Well, it's a Georgia Georgia quarter. I had a few of those. Back in the day when you they got uh, it? Yeah. One more should do it. Back in the day when they like made the state quarters, I actually collected. I had like one of those maps that they had, and I collected every single quarter. No big deal. And then I threw them all away because I don't care. 
So much for collecting things. I'd make a terrible Pokemon master. There's our way out, Lee. That is not as big as I remember it. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. No. You know you don't have to do this, right? I know. I just want to go home. This will help us get back home. I like your <sighs> okay. rationale. All right, let's get Clementine up there. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. She's the only one that can actually fit through there. Here's hoping she makes it. And the St. John's aren't like sitting there waiting at the other end of the air conditioner. That was loud. What happened? Clem? Are you okay? Did anyone see you? No, but there's a man outside. Probably Let Andy me. or Danny. Gotta go. Leave me alone. Wait, I can see him. It's not safe in here. For God's sake, Lee. Didn't even get to say goodbye. Get in here. I got an idea. Lily, I am seriously sorry. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Honestly, on most of my playthroughs, I choose Lily's side at that point, but there's a reason I chose Kenny uh, at this point. So welcome back to Behind the uh, Door. Man, this is a messed up place. So much blood. So much of Mark's blood. Oh my, are those... There was something up with this room. It's a goddamn human slaughterhouse. Well, hell, we didn't know that until now. Alright, so at this point, we can do a few things. We have to, first of all, pick out our weapon. We have a cattle prod, a sickle, and a hay hook. I personally like the sickle. Because. Communists love sickles. It's like one of the symbols on the flags or whatever. It's like communist Russia has it or maybe. Something. The hammer and the sickle. Because uh, Batman. Batman Arkham City. They had the two villains. Mr. Hammer and Mr. Sick. Mr. Blah. Who cares? Abramovich. Those guys. Alright, let's head on out. It's Danny. I would not mind killing Danny. Quite honestly. What's the plan? So what's the plan? That dumbass is so caught up in his own rant that we could probably sneak right up on him. Just stick behind me in case anything goes down. When we get to the front, grab his gun. Sounds good. Okay, you ready? Well, that's a decent enough plan. Let's do it. Yeah, let's go. Stay close. Alright. Carrot Lee, you should probably get down. I've had way more glitches than I had in the past with this game. What's taking long to end so long? What are they? Finishing the damn dinner first? Could have been made a plate at least. Hey, get that gun, get that what gun. What are you doing outside the bar? Oh, oh, fuck. Shit. Just guarding the place like you said. Well, we're sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. One to keep. What's he doing out there? Kill the I don't know. Can I pick which one to keep an eye on? Not the kid. I don't know if I'll know. keep an eye on it. Be ready to act when I say. See what he's doing now. All right. Oh, I we know, can man. check this outside the door. When I let Make sure one think they can walk right out. <laughs> they never even look down. Lee, focus. Where's Danny? Right out fucking side. He would have seen me. Okay. We're doing that. He's uh, he's just out Take there. Take a look through the cracks. I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. See where he is now. Well, no, he didn't go past us. Hopefully. Oh yay! No. Nope. Ah! 
I'm dead. Mostly because I pressed the wrong button. For whatever reason, I went for the R2 button instead of the X button. Anyway. Look out and grab this guy. It's not that difficult. Get sickle! Get sickle! Oh. I like how he takes takes that out and just goes, Thank you, Kenny. How did you get the sickle? Nice. We got him to clip right into that bear trap. Where's my family, asshole? You can't have them. We need the vet. No! Can't! Lee, come on! Just go. I won't be far behind. Danny, you are a creepy mother. You, you understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. Get part of yourself so others can live. God damn it, you are fucked up. Cannibalism is not the answer. Aren't the walkers eating enough of us? You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like he didn't kill Jolene. You don't have what it takes. <laughs> Fucking coward. This is not how the world works now. You won't make me kill you. Fuck you, Lee. You and Kenny murder my dad, but you leave this piece of shit alive? Fucking asshole. Fuck you, Lily. Your dad was gonna die. Oh god, don't hurt him! That's gotcha! Please, no! Lily, please, keep her safe. Here's hoping she won't hurt a kid for no reason. She may kill Danny. In fact, I would not blame her if she kills Danny. God, that guy is like the creepiest dude ever. He's a, he is a, he's a fucking weirdo. I wonder Kenny. why he's a mama's boy. Where you at, Kenny? That's a pretty moon. I'm surprised the moon got past the clouds on a freaking stormy night like this. All right. That's a walker. Should probably, yeah, that's a walker. We should probably run. Cause I kind of broke the electric fence. Oh, hey, Carly. Lee. Ow. Shh. Is everyone okay? We heard screams as we were coming up to the house. Well, they kind of fucking attacked us. They attacked us! I knew it! I told you we couldn't trust them! Shit! How many of them are there? Two left! Where? Larry's dead! They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us! Shit! Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja at the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. Alright, we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. Well, there is a back way in. That's how me and Mark got back after he got shot in the back with an arrow. So we know they'll make it. Hopefully. No, 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 no. She's in the house. Alright, let's sneak. Oh, I'm gonna take the boy and check around. No, back. please don't take my boy. Let's go, woman. Crap, they got duck. Okay. We Andy? Will get... Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? Oh, God. Frightened by the... Okay, so... It literally does not matter what you choose. <laughs> in that situation, because if you Please pretend to be... Back. Don't come in here. You just... Let her go, Brenda. Brenda, there's the door. <clears throat> we don't want please, to do this. Please, don't you take another step. Brenda, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. 
All right, I'm actually gonna go ahead and end the part right here. In the next part, we will finish off episode two and hopefully save Katja from the likes of Brenda. So anyway, thank you very much for watching. Be sure to like and favorite the park as every like and favorite helps. Subscribe to the channel for more Walking Dead content so you can stay up to date. Leave a comment telling me what you think about the episode so far and do something else, who knows. Just don't, don't point a gun at someone's mother. That generally does not end well. Thanks for watching. I'll see all of you guys next time.